the Bay Area's local news station. You're watching Cron 4 News at 6. They will not be used to cruise up and down Oakland. Uh, like I said earlier, they'll be very used for very specific uh, reasons, search and rescue. Now at 6 o'clock, there will soon be more eyes in the sky. This is part of an effort to tackle crime in Oakland. The police department has announced a new drone program designed to keep citizens and officers safer. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Con4 News at 6. I'm Katherine Heenan in and, for Pam Moore. And I'm Ken Wayne. The drones came as a private donation and will only be used in specific scenarios. Con4's Dan Kerman explains. These drones are part of a new program being launched by the Oakland Police Department. They'll be very used for very specific uh, reasons, search and rescue, which I think is key. Uh, when we have remote areas like someone missing uh, up in the Oakland Hills, when we have uh, someone that we know we want to cover a large area, uh, these vehicles will be used to support that effort. The drones are similar to the ones used by the Alameda County Sheriff's Office, and the chief says they will not only free up officers, but keep them safer. When we talk about high-risk search warrants, like I mentioned, where we have to go into a location where we know it, put, it poses a potential safety risk to the officers. It'd be best to actually get a visual on that particular area. The chief says the OPD drone program has the approval of the city council and the city's privacy advisory commission. Recorded video can be kept for only five days unless tied to a criminal investigation, and no artificial intelligence or facial recognition will be collected. The chief says drones may be used to curb sideshow activity, but will not be used to cruise Oakland streets or as a surveillance tool during protests, at least not now. But I do think that that's things that we can, you know, revisit at some point if we feel like it's an appropriate tool. Uh, I think it's something that we'll go back to the Privacy Commission if that, if we think that it could be effective. And I think, you know, we, we, we do like to have an aerial view when it comes to crowd management situations, but, but we won't be using this uh, initially uh, in those situations. The drone program was funded by an $80,000 grant from California Waste Solutions and the Oakland Chinatown Improvement Council. Hopefully this will keep Oakland safe, not just Chinatown, because we could easily just provide one or two drones, but we provided enough drones to cover the entire city. Right now, Oakland is starting with three drones. They hope to expand to eight. Dan Kerman, Cron 4 News.